What's up? This is Jared from the Dirty Heads. You are watching Wheeler's Weekend Jams live and direct. Wheeler's Weekend Jams live and direct. Wheeler's Weekend Jams here live and direct at Riot Fest 2015. And here is Mr. Dirty J from the Dirty Heads. How you doing, sir? Hey, I'm doing good. How has uh, Chicago and this Riot Fest experience been so far? I just woke up like an hour ago. Don't know. Really? You know what I was surprised? That it's cold in Chicago in the summertime. And you know what I say in a lot of interviews? And I'm not saying that because I'm here, but Chicago is my favorite big city in the summertime. You know? It's not as busy as New York. It's LA's LA. I live pretty much there. Chicago's my jam. Chicago's my favorite. So it's good to get back because we didn't hit it on the sub, uh, Slightly Stupid Tour. So it's good to like, and this is our last day of a two month tour. Yeah. We're going home tomorrow. Oh. So it's like oh, nice. zero fucks. Re relaxation is in the house. And uh, I just saw you guys just came out with a video from Red Rocks uh, that you just put out. How was that? How was that? Uh, I know you guys um, always have a great experience playing there, but how was that last show there? Y you know what's crazy about Red Rocks is, is it's like, uh, it's I would compare it to like runner's high or anybody that's like an athlete where you compete and you play a game or you do something and it's over and you don't really remember it, you know? Like that's how Red Rocks kind of was this last time. Like we played it, you're so fucking hyped, everything, there's so much energy that when it's done you're just like, that went by really, really fast, you know? It's, 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 it's a whole different animal, you know? Exactly. I have to ask, um, I always check out your guys' Facebook posts, and what is with the grizzly bear with Duddy B in every picture? Nothing at all. Well, that's why it's so funny. <laughs> like, there's just nothing. He just, we were super high, and he was like, ah, look at these, and he started making these bear memes, and they're really funny, so he started posting them, and then people, like, caught on, and now everybody loves the bear, and now it has its own Instagram page. There's nothing behind it. <laughs> Zero message or like meaning yeah, exactly. behind it. Well, this is a really special interview uh, for me because I was telling you earlier, uh, last time I saw you guys was on the 311 cruise. Yeah, Didn't get to hit you up. Uh, how, was, uh, how was that uh, 311 cruise experience? Uh, it was our second one and we would never turn it down. It's, it's rad. Like, uh, I mean, you're on a cruise ship for a couple days, you play a couple shows, you get to go to Jamaica. It's a, it's a vacation and you get to play music for cool people. You know, you, it doesn't get much better than that. And I think we're going to do a Sublime with Rome Dirty Heads cruise in 2016. Oh, snap. Pack your shorts, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Well, uh, so, so you said you're off now for the next two months. Uh, what is next now for the Dirty Heads? Um, we're actually writing right now and thinking about the new album. Uh, take a little time to relax. I'm actually doing a solo hip-hop uh, EP, like little project that I've been working on for the last couple months with some really dope hip-hop producers. I'll go home and finish that while working on the Dirty Heads stuff. We have a couple fly dates, some festivals. Um, but, you know, usually the end of the year, we're gone so much during the rest of the year that we like to hang out with our families, chill out a little bit, but we're always working and always writing music and, you know, planning the next year and what we're going to do. So it's just a, a lot more um, creative side of the band. Like we're going to be doing more merch designs and um, like I said, just writing more music, you know. Cool. Awesome, man. Well, uh, there's one more question I have to ask you. I ask every band this, but um, if you had to compare the Dirty Heads to a movie, what movie would it be and why? Damn, that's good. I wish you would have like hit me up like a week ago. Because like, the first person that said the right answer will come in like two days. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's like uh, fuck. It's oh. okay. The Goonies, dazed and confused. Fearing, Loathing in Las Vegas, and, uh, Akira, and the Care Bears sequel, too. <laughs> I don't even know if there is one. I don't know either, but that's... Okay, pretty good answer. We'll take it. Um, well, hey, man, thank you so much for doing this interview, and uh, I appreciate it. Mr. Dirty J, man, appreciate it. And we're out. <laughs> Can you tell me that the 